time to this lesson on subtraction. And this time, we are going to have missing parts in here. We're going to have to find what we have to take away to get the answer. So, just looking at this, we have a 3, and we're taking away some number we don't know yet. And that's going to be equal to 1. So, we're going to have 1 left over. Because remember that subtraction is taken away. So, over here is the, the amount that we have at the beginning. And then this area is where we take them away. This, the, the number here take, tells us the amount that we will take away. And this is how many that's left over. So, let's look at this. So we have 3, and here's the 3, here are the 3, and we're going to take away some, and we're going to have 1 left over. So we want to have 1 left over in the answer. So just by looking at this, so we have 1, 2, 3, and we're going to take away some, and we're going to have 1 left over. So... Let's think about this. To have one left over, to have one left over, these two have to be gone. So these two have to be taken away so we can have this one left over. So that means. These two should be gone to have this one left. So that means three minus or three take away two, those two red ones, is equal to one. And here is the one. Let's try another example, where we can have um, 4, and we're going to take away some amount, and we're going to be left with 2. So 4 take away some number is equal to 2. Let's take a look at that with our marbles our blue marbles so we have four and we're gonna take away some and we're gonna write them here and we're gonna have two left so think about it hmm I have four and I have to take away some to have two left, left over. So, let's say these two will be left over. So we have to take these away. We have to take these away, right? We have to take these two away, so we can have two left over, which is that. So, I'll take these two away. And now we can see that, actually, four, take away the two red ones, is equal to one, two. The two that's left over here. One, two. Okay, another example. We're going to do four. Take away some number. But this time we will have one left. So four. Take away some number. 
and we'll have one left over. Let's look at that. So we're going to get four. One, two, three, four. So we have four. And we're going to take away some. So that we're left with one. So how many will we take away from this four? To have one left over. So let's say we want this one to be left over. I'll put it here. So you can clearly see how much we will have to take away from this group to have this one left over. I see I need to take away... It's looking like three, right? It is looking like three. One, two, three. These three need to be taken away from all the four to have one left over. So, I get these three out of here. And I'm left with one. Four... Minus or four take away three is equal to one that is left over right here. Here's the one. All right, let's try another example. We're going to do five. Take away some number equal to 1. So 5 take away some number is equal to 1. Let's see. Let's get our 5. So let's get our 5. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So we have our 5. And we're going to take away some number to equal 1. So we want 1 to be left over. Alright, so let me move everything down here a little bit. So, we have five. And I want just one left over. So just by doing this, I can see... I'm, I'm gonna have to take away these guys. So I can have one left over. Like what the answer says. See? Five. Take away some amount. Is gonna equal to one. Here's the one that's going to be left over, so I have to take these away. And how many are they? Ah, uh, we have... One, two, three, we have four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three... And four. So we need to take these four away to have the one that's left over. So let's get rid of them. So now we know it's four, right? So it's the five. Take away the four reds that we had. And that's equal to 1. Here it is. And let's do one more example. This time we're going to do 5 take away some number. And that's going to equal to 3. So 5 take away some marbles. 5 marbles take away some is equal to 3. And let's find how many. So we're going to start with 5. So we start with 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 
five marbles and we're going to take away some we don't know how many yet but we're gonna have three leftovers so we're gonna have one two three left so we have to take these away out of the five so we can have these three left over you see I'll do it one more time for you to see it. We start with five. We're gonna take away some to have three left over. Three at the end. So here's the three that we're, you know, we're gonna be, we're gonna have at the end. So we have to take these guys away. So let's, it's gonna be one and two. These two. One, two. Okay, I'll write it now. So five. Take away one, two. These two. We're left with one, two, three. This is equal to three. And that is all for this lesson. Bye!